We're backstage here in Sacramento, and I am joined by a victorious Alan Joban. Alan, heading into this fight with Mike Perry, there was a lot of animosity, which is something we don't traditionally see with you and opponents. Yeah. Is there an extra sweetness to this victory because of it? I mean, you know, there is, and I, I don't, I didn't take this fight personally as if I hated Mike Perry. There was a lot of buildup, a lot of disrespect during fight week, things that really I didn't like. And, and my coach has said one thing to me before going out there. He said, uh, my, my son asked me yesterday, I was FaceTiming him, and he said, uh, he, he said, Dad, why'd you try to kick that guy on stage at the weigh-in? And, and I said, Cage, because he's a bully, and Daddy doesn't tolerate bullies. And, and, and my coach reminded me of that going in, and uh, I just didn't want to um, let my son down. I wanted to show him what I tell him, I believe in it. And so that was kind of more, not a personal vendetta against Mike, but more so wanting to... Uh, show my family and my loved ones that I stand for what I believe in. Well, you certainly were able to do just that. I want to talk to you about your coaches, as you mentioned them. It seemed like their advice between the first and second round was really crucial to you. It, it seemed like they asked you to throw more kicks. Maybe in the first round you weren't throwing as many as we saw, and then you were really able to control the distance in the second and third with those kicks. Yeah. Was the advice in the corner something that sort of changed your game in the second and third? Yeah, I feel like not only as a fighter am I the most evolved that I've ever been, but um, my team, man, I've got the best coaches that I've ever had, and we're, we're not only the best coaches, but it's, it's just how you work together cohesively. And, and we just found a rhythm this and last camp that we're just, we're just hitting on all cylinders. And they found the openings uh, in, in between rounds, and they told me how to do it, how to respond, and I was able to respond, and I, I have trust in them. You know, I told my conditioning coach, let me know that I'm not tired. Tell me when there's a minute left. I've pushed this minute a thousand times, and he did that. Kenny been working with me on bolt wrestling for three years now. I've never shot a freaking takedown in my life, and I took him down three times this fight. So that's a big hurdle that I overcame, and my striking is more evolved than it's ever been. So I just feel like we're working together on all cylinders finally, and this is the new Alan Joban that everybody has to fight now. It's not just the guy that goes out there and gets in barn burners. It's the guy that's going to take you down, submit you, or outstrike you every round too. You sure, certainly showed an impressive display of skills tonight. You were very well-rounded. Um, moving forward, I know you have some things that you would like the UFC to know. What are those? I'm ready for it, man. I, I you know, I got no disrespect against any of these guys. No, uh, but I called out Matt Brown before this fight. I called out Donald Cerrone. I called out um, Canadian, whoever. I called out a bunch of people, man. Didn't get any of those fights. I got Mike Perry. I said, you know what, let's do it. But I want them to know now that this is my eighth or ninth fight in the UFC. That's five out of the last six that I've won. That's three wins in a row, three fight of the night bonuses, three first round knockouts, two standing up. I mean, I just want to tell you my whole resume because every time you guys put trust in me, I come through for you. I always deliver exciting, exciting fights. The fans know who I am. They love to watch me fight. I've proven myself to you. And I'm, nobody's more deserving than me to be in the rankings after this fight. And nobody, even if they were equal with my, my, my resume, nobody does it with style points that I do. I deserve to be in the top 15s next week. I, 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 I look forward to seeing it. And from there, I want to main event something, man. You know, I've, I've co-mained event my second fight in the UFC. Uh, this is my third or fourth main card and pay-per-view. Let's main event something. The fans know me. Put me in the rankings. Give me a ranked opponent, and let's do it. I hope to see those things in your future, Alan. Very well-deserved. Congratulations Thank on this you. victory. Thank you.